my name is Pastor Kevin Bergman, and I'm here to introduce to you one of the newest ministries at St. Peter, which is the prayer group. Now you might ask, what is the prayer group? Prayer group isn't a club in the church. Prayer group isn't a board. It's not an organization that has bylaws and an agenda. Instead, the prayer group is what the, what the name implies, and that simply is a group of Christians in the congregation who gather together in front of the altar of God every Tuesday night at seven o'clock for the purpose of simply praying. You might ask, why do we do this? The first reason that we come together to pray is in response to the command of God that we find in 1 Thessalonians chapter 5, verse 17, where we're told to pray continually. Second, another reason why we come together to pray is because of the incredible promise of Jesus that you find in John 16, verse 23, where Jesus says, I tell you the truth, if you ask my Father anything in my name, he will give it to you. And then, why do we pray together as a group? One of the main reasons that we come together to pray as a group is because of another great promise of Jesus that he tells us in Matthew chapter 18, where Jesus says, I tell you that if two of you on earth agree about anything you ask for, it will be done for you by my Father in heaven. For where two or three come together in my name, there I am in the midst of them. We pray for anyone whose need is brought to us for whatever need they have. We also pray for what's going on here at St. Peter, in our nation, and in our world. There is no limit to what we'll pray for and who we include in our prayers. This is the great part. Anyone who feels moved to come can join us on any Tuesday night. You can come one week or you can come every week. It's all up to you. It's pretty simple. We take turns praying every week. We gather as a group in front of the altar and we take turns praying. Some in the group are comfortable making up their own prayers and praying them out loud. And some pray the prayers that are written out for them. And some just stand by as silent supporters. However we pray, we pray in Jesus' name. When we are all done, we all try to take the list home and use it in our daily prayer and devotional time. That way, each concern and prayer is brought before the Lord multiple times each week. Even if you can't make it, but you have a prayer request, you can send your prayer request to either Pastor Bergman, and his email is listed on the screen, or to myself, Rita Phillips. You could text me, and that number is also listed on the screen. So please join us on Tuesday nights at 7 p.m. for prayer group. Everyone's welcome. And remember, God is good all the time.